Hi, KG1C. Well, today is Superhero Day. You might wonder why I have this interesting hairdo with a pink bow, and I'll tell you why. Because if I were a superhero, I would fly around a lot, and I wouldn't want my hair to get all my face. And you might wonder, why is Miss Heather wearing a rainbow shirt? That's a little crazy. Well, you know I love rainbows. And if I were a superhero, it might be part of my outfit. So we're going to read a book that I just found today, but I love it. And I'm so excited to read it to you. And it's about how to make yourself a superhero. And that's going to be part of our seesaw assignment today. The book is called Superhero Instruction Manual. Now, do you have what it takes to be a hero? Ultravision goggles, bones of steel, powerful muscles, supersonic cape, and bam bam boots. Wow, there's a lot of different superheroes. Superhero Instruction Manual. Do you have what it takes to be a hero and save the world? Are your muscles made of elastic? Are your bones made of steel? I think this little boy is thinking, I'm just, I'm just a boy. He looks like he's in KG1. <gasps> Can you soar through the air with the single leap? Uh-oh, bonk. Never fear, our one-of-a-kind super instruction manual will turn you super in seven easy steps. So they're going to tell us seven things to do to be a superhero. That step one, choose a super name. Hmm, that can be a hard one. Because, like, I'm like, what am I, Miss Super Heather? Or, uh, I don't know. Need help? Combine your favorite color with your favorite animal. Be the green tiger or pink python. With two little words, you sound super, super. And the green tiger says, kabow. Um, if I did that, I would be like pink seahorse. Hmm. That's kind of a strange... <laughs> Pink seahorse is a I don't know if that, well, I'll keep thinking about my name. Step two, pick a partner. Holy Joe Nut Hero, you need a sidekick. Choose wisely. Remember, your sidekick, like a helper, will look up to you and hope to become a hero too. Do you think, look at his sister's like, me, 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 me. And then does he pick the sister or the dog? And the sister's a little sad. Step three, craft a super disguise. That means your outfit. Unitard, pow, mask, bam, boots, boom, cape, shazam. What's he using for his cape? Is that his towel? His bath towel? That's a good idea. Are you feeling super yet? Oh. Is his sister dressed up as something? Hmm. Step four, secure a super hideout. Every superhero needs a secret lair. That's like a place to plan strategy and prepare to save the world. Wait a minute. Is his sister following him everywhere he goes to make a lair? Hmm. Oh, he's in a treehouse that says no sisters. It must be safe from evil villain intruders. Mm. Step five, choose your superpower. Superheroes don't just wake up one day with amazing powers. You must work hard to discover your inner bam, boom, pow. Underwater breathing? Does it look like he can breathe underwater? He's going, ah, ah, ah. Super spawn, supersonic speed? <gasps> Crash. Invisibility? That's when no one can see you. Uh-oh. Flying it is. 
Okay, if I was a super superhero, flying would be my number one superpower. And I'm gonna tell you my second on the seesaw assignment. <gasps> Step six, store up super energy. Being super requires a lot of power. Be sure to be sure to eat a mega size breakfast. Whoa, there's a lot of pancakes. And remember to stash, stash, that means save a snack. Step seven, most important, save the world. It's time to take action, hero. Show the world what you're made of. Here I am to save the, wait, Fluffy, no. The dog is his is his partner dog chasing a squirrel. Wow! Let's look where his let's look, here's let's look where his dog's going. I jump on the table, spill everything. I love this page. Do you see him right here? He's chasing his dog all around and still chasing a mirror all around, all around here and all, oh my gosh, through the fountain and all. I'm getting tired all around here and kaboom. Maybe his dog is not the best partner. I don't know. Congratulations. You've now completed the seven steps to becoming a hero. You should feel super. Does it look like he feels super here or here? Before long, you'll be surrounded by adoring fans begging for your help. Do those people look a little cranky that his dog made a mess? Uh-oh. So be prepared. Sometimes the world needs saving two or three times before lunch. Oh, is his sister doing some super helping? She's being a superhero, cleaning up the water, throwing away the garbage, helping this old man, and, and she's fixing a bike. <gasps> and she brought back the dog. Hey, that sister's a superhero too. There are all kinds of heroes. Hey, did he share his cape with his sister? Give it to her. Super nice. But a true superhero is always there when it counts. Uh-oh, sister's gonna fall and <gasps> he caught her. That is being a superhero. So go forth. That means go on and be super. And now the sign says, he crossed out, no, it says sisters are super. So all three of them can be superheroes. Because anybody can be a superhero in real life. You just have to try your best to help people. And that is the end. And... I can't wait to see on your seesaw assignment how you're going to be a superhero. I think you will like this one. Try it out. Maybe you won't, but I think you might like it. And you'll see what kind of superhero I would make me. I'll give you a clue. Pink, well, pink bow. Oh, because so I can't fly around with my hair going everywhere. That would be too crazy. All right. I love you all, and I miss you, and I hope you're having a super superhero day. And to say bye-bye, I have to do this and say bye-bye. Sending lots of love, super love to you and your families.